New tweet from CEO Adam Aaron. He says AMC moviegoers continue to eat and drink well. Two weeks ago, we set an all-time record with the highest weekly food and beverage revenues per patron, or FBRPP, in AMC's 103-year history. On March 24th, 25th, 26th, we set a new record again for the highest ever weekend of FBRPP. An orangutan ape down below said, Profitability is within reach, revenue is improving month over month, and we have yet to include the AMC Perfectly Popcorn. Short sellers are watching the light at the end of the tunnel fading quickly. Choke on that. It was also said by CEO Adam Aaron a long time ago that the profit margins when it comes to food and beverage are very, very high. So if AMC is setting records as far as food and beverage or FBRPP, that means that the profitability on the next earnings report should be very, very good. Comment down below when it comes to food and beverage what your favorite item that they sell at AMC theaters. Mine are definitely the popcorn and the candy. We do have a new article to go through. The game is rigged, says ex-Citadel data scientist. Patrick M., an ex-Citadel data scientist, said during the meme stock frenzy that the stock market is rigged and claiming he helped design it. The game is not fair and it has never been. Individual investors, even when operating in a swarm, are destined to lose. How do I know? I helped design the game. Not many investors know this, but Patrick actually breaks down how Citadel and other hedge funds were able to make billions back in only weeks from the halt. Patrick said a few years ago, I worked at a massive hedge fund, Citadel, the massive fund that was caught up in the scandal involving Robin Hood, Melvin Capital, and others. He said my role at Citadel was to engineer a long-term quantitative strategy. The entire department filled with programmers and compliance officers is dedicated to something called Alpha, which determines the buying strategy of the fund. He then said I was responsible for innovative technology that capitalizes on public data faster than any other hedge fund. It's a classic situation of machines versus humans. I respect many of my colleagues. The problem isn't the people. It's the rules of the game which heavily favors the funds.